Okay, now this is literally the million dollar question. How much cash do you need? Let me uh, throw a question out there, just so that I can get a sense of uh, the state of mind. How much do you think is a minimum amount of money that you would need to get an investment visa approved? I'm just, let me ask you, what do you think that number is? Just curious. How much? 10 million? You don't, you don't need 10 million, definitely not. How about you? What do you think? Half a million? Any other ideas? Yeah, yeah, which is, which is absolutely accurate. Um, however, when you go into a, an application for an investment visa, what you really want to do is to be able to put your head on the pillow and sleep well at night, knowing that you're not going to get denied because you don't have enough money. Now, it may be that your business plan really only calls for $100,000, $150,000, but I can tell you the Immigration Department are not going to accept that. In my experience, if you have between half a million and a million Hong Kong dollars available to the business in real cash terms, you can tick that box normally. Unless, of course, you know, you're going to, um, you're going to engage in a business that requires have a much greater amount of capital and you put forward this wonderful business plan and you haven't got anywhere close to enough capital to actually deliver on that plan, then you'll get denied on that basis. So you've got to have sufficient capital to, to, to fund the plan that you've got. But ticking the box half a million to a million is about it. Now, it's not a hard and fast rule, but uh, when clients come to us and I say, right, how much cash have you got? And they, they tell me the number, I can say, right, you can tick that box. I know you're going to need to think about that. Now, the interesting thing here is that the Immigration Department expect to see some of that money in the company bank account, but they're also quite happy to accept that you've got other funds available to you in other banks, bank accounts located anywhere in the world, as long as they're in your own name and they're readily accessible, um, that you can draw down on to help you support your business plan. Because the Immigration Department look at your ability to fund the business in the round. So you definitely need to have money in your company bank account, but if you don't have all of it in your company bank account and you've got uh, a cash or, or cash um, uh, equivalent assets elsewhere, then that will be uh, acceptable to the Immigration Department as a source of funding. Yeah. Do you know the breakdown of that? Like how much we would need within the country and how much we can have somewhere else? It depends how much cash you need to finance yourself for the first six months um, locally. But I'd say if you've got half a million, put 300,000 in your company bank account and have 200,000 standby ready to bring in as and when you need it.